One cause of hyperthyroidism is Graves' disease, which is often suspected on exam based on the presence of a large goiter. Graves' disease is an autoimmune thyroid disease where patients have antibodies against the TSH receptors on the thyroid. This leads to increased production of thyroid hormone, which when released into the blood, acts back at the level of the pituitary to inhibit TSH secretion. The TSH receptor antibodies can also affect the extraocular muscles, which can lead to proptosis or protrusion of the eyes, as well as affect the extraocular movements. Due to the constant stimulation of the thyroid gland by the TSH receptor antibodies, patients also often have a diffuse goiter. The labs seen with Graves' disease are consistent with high levels of thyroid hormone and suppression of the TSH, but the labs are not specific for Graves' disease. You can measure the TSH receptor antibodies, which are positive in 75 to 100 percent of patients and are very specific for the diagnosis of Graves' disease. Imaging can also be helpful in making the diagnosis of Graves' disease. On ultrasound, the thyroid will be very vascular, what is sometimes referred to as the thyroid inferno. This is due to the constant stimulation of the thyroid by the TSH receptor antibodies. On radioactive iodine scan, patients with Graves' disease will show markedly increased uptake due to the high levels of thyroid hormone being produced, and the uptake will be diffuse due to the stimulation of the entire thyroid gland by the TSH receptor antibodies.